This is uh, the average female, which have the, the shape of the torso and the, the hips and the pelvis uh, of, of a female, in addition to the length, of course, and the weight. So the, um, and when it comes to geometry of the torso, you, we would have, for the female compared to the male, a uh, more narrow shoulder area and a wider um, hip area. And then, uh, of course, the, the distribution of mass is different throughout the torso, which results in a lower center of gravity for the female compared to the male. The muscles in, in the neck is weaker normally in, in, a, in a woman. So you can see if you compare this with a human model or with a male dummy, you can see this, this neck is more flexible and has more movements if you perform exactly the same crash test, the same speed and the same deacceleration. The aim hopefully is to make it possible to make better seats both for women and men. That's the reason why we had created one man and one woman.